my people my people my people good morning how y'all doing how y'all doing praise be to god on this beautiful wonderful day it's gonna be a heat wave today but who we still gotta go out there you know this is america we gotta go out there and we gotta make our daily bread yes we gotta go make our daily bread but this morning i just want to bless everyone i just want to lift everyone up this morning and hope that you woke up this morning with joy in your heart and peace in your soul now remember i talked about the 30-day challenge today is the 27th day okay we started this on monday so today's wednesday right so today's the third day and I hope you have been praying for the people who hurt you, the people who cause you pain. I pray you've been praying for the blessings of God upon their life and that God would give them joy and peace and, and bless them in all that they do and everywhere that they go. People, it's not easy to pray for your enemy. It's not easy to pray for people who you know that are hurting you daily. It's not easy to pray for people that you know when you turn your back they're slandering you it's not easy to pray for people that when you get in their midst their attitudes are so vicious towards you but guess what you don't have to be them because there's a core reason for their situation there's a core reason for their behavior there's a core reason for their actions and when we we are drawn away by our own desires you know and when we get like that the enemy have what to come in and sit and feed on and then turn us into puppets but we will not be like those people this morning we will pray for them lord bless my enemy Lord, prosper my enemy. Lord, prosper their children. Yes, Father God. Touch their afflicted bodies and heal them, Father God. Lord, grant them the desires of their heart that is according to your will, plan, and purpose for their lives. Yes, man. You have to pray for your enemy. Don't this scripture say if you pray for your enemy, it will eat coal, heap coals of fire on the head. Yeah, man. It will, it, I pray it will touch their consciences. I pray the Holy Spirit will reach out to them and let them realize how they're allowing themselves to be destroyed by the things they are doing and feeling and they should recognize that those are spirit and where those spirits are coming from so they can rebuke them and be delivered from them yeah man bless your enemy an enemy come from uh, enemies can be your neighbors your family members your friends your co-workers sometimes you have enemies who just see you don't even know you and just don't like you yes man you have people become your enemy because of your personality and who you are enemy comes in all shape and form and sizes and from every direction but this morning if you know if you are felt the hurt and pain from anyone i'm asking you this morning 30 days pray for them and pray only good prayers pray for god to bless them to keep them to elevate them yes because sometimes folks if we get hurt and we start to behave in the hurt we become the very people that are hurting us and hurting people will always hurt people we don't want that we want to be different we are set apart we come out from among them we're in the world and not of the world and today the heart of man is desperately wicked don't let your heart become a heart of stone keep it as a heart of flesh okay love your neighbor as you love yourself hey and you don't have to have no reason to love nobody you just need to love them because god commanded you to Mm. and love don't mean you're in their way and let them abuse and use you know you know no that's not what i mean but this day if, if you never heard this before 30 days pray goodness for every anybody who have hurt you who keeps on hurting you who who the pain is so deep you never think you can forgive and forgive them because for, forgiveness is not for the person forgiveness is for you because the, the Lord goes so far as to say do not let the sun go down on your wrath 
So this morning, let go the hurt. Let go the pain. Put, ask God for put that love in your heart and peace and pray for them. And watch what God do for you. Pray for them. Now remember, greater is he that is in the world than... Sorry. Remember, greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. Okay? So go on. Go be great. Go be great today. And remember, if you get the opportunity to be the hands and feet of Jesus for somebody who is in need, jump to the opportunity. Now you all have a blessed and awesome productive day. I pray for promotions today. I pray for pay increase today. I pray for somebody to get nearer to the Lord today. I pray, I pray for deep spiritual centeredness for us all today. Remember now, Jesus loves you, and so do I. Bye-bye-bye.